Ooh, what do we get here? Um, doo -doo -doo -tsh. So this is a good, yeah, we got the Fangs, we got the Phoenix. Got a good unit mix and we are getting the uh, giant units for free, more or less. Not too bad. All right. Oh, God damn. I'm going to put them into my standard formation. We want the small units here to protect the, the phoenixes, so we're putting them in front. And then we need a little bit of distance here, so they don't clump into uh, smaller units. Uh, because the phoenix range, when you start out, is not that great. <laughs> you can upgrade it, but you need to wait for that. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get... I'm actually gonna unlock Sledgehammers. I'm gonna buy one more of these. He has sledgehammers and oh man, that's a pretty strong. Uh... I mean, stone crawlers would have been worse, but the crawlers are pretty annoying here. Might not have enough to deal with it. We'll see. We will see though. All right, Let's see what happens. Hopefully, this works out. Waiting for the enemy. There we go. All right. So his, yeah, he's gonna devastate my forces here, and these are not gonna hit. This is bad. He did a good place. He did some good placement on his units, and he has uh, snipers that are gonna shoot my. Unfortunate. Yeah. I knew that this would be an issue. Fangs are not great against the uh, the crawlers. Unless you have ignite. Ignite is decent, but yeah. Um, decrease the tech upgrade cost. Could be good for future. For the future. Giant unit cost. I'm going to go with the tech because we're going to have to take a lot. So, I'm going to counter his... Uh, or not counter, but I'm going to try to... Kill his um, crawlers by going for the sledgehammers here. Um, I don't want them to be hit by the marksmen, so I'm actually going to put them in the side. So they don't get destroyed immediately. Because I need them to take out the, the crawlers. Um, question is, do we have enough? I mean, we can't really put any more down. We can... We can get a Vulcan early here, so just counter his crawlers completely. Probably a good idea, but... Hmm. Is he gonna go more crawlers? I think he's gonna go more sledgehammers. So maybe we can just wait. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this. Right. Yeah, he went more sledgehammers. That's good. Only one group though, so he did get another marksman too. He has a uh, utility marksman. Actually has like a carry utility build, that's kind of wild. These are made for tanking. He has the same idea as me. Oh, we don't have enough yet. Phoenix is gonna get shut down. Left side is winning though, which is good. Um, I should be able to kill his tower. No, oh, okay. That's good. That's actually good. Because now his dies and he has uh, damage reduction. Yeah, easy win. He doesn't have any more anti air. Yeah, yeah. I've played against King Camelot before, by the way. I think I've played against him like four times or something. Ooh. Ooh, Scorpion. Wraith is good here too. But he does have uh, he does have his uh, marksman, so it's it makes the wraith really bad. Um, steel balls are kind of okay. Arc lights are um, also okay. I think it's gonna be a scorpion here. It has to. 
So that unlocks the Scorpion tech and also gives us a Scorpion, a level 2 Scorpion, which is very good. <laughs> so hopefully it doesn't go Scorpion, so we're just going to go two more groups of um, Sledges. Uh, I kind of wanted another Scorpion, but I can't get one. Um, we can upgrade these guys. I think that's going to be okay. So now we have our Chaff, like the basic Chaff. We have a extra... Maybe I put this man more in the middle here. I kind of want this to kill the marksman eventually. And kill the... Sledges. So I think this is best. Hmm. Yeah. I think we have a good basic here. And we even have some phoenixes. So this is actually like really damn good. I kind of still want to level the Vulcan. Just in case. Um... Yeah, he's, he's focusing on scrollers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of knew he would do that, man. We, we might have to throw a Vulcan into the mix here. Hopefully we get like a shield upgrade for the Vulcan, so we can uh, have a portable shield with it. He also went for the Scorpion, which is bad for me. Very bad. And he's like reinforcing his uh, snipers here. It's not gonna work though, because the Scorpion does too much damage. Fuck man, we lost our tower to the Crawlers. Yeah, this is bad. I just need to kill the shield, it's very important. Oh dude, come on. Okay, shield down, good. Yeah, this is a big issue. His Crawlers are devastating me. And he even upgraded them, so... Yeah, we're gonna take a lot of damage. Holy! Ooh, early game crawlers are so uh, devastating. Oh, we got a barrier! Oh my god, I can't believe it. Okay, we're, that's easy win. I'm gonna put this guy right here. We're gonna put a barrier on. We just solved the crawler issue. We're gonna do another one here. Alright, so these two guys are gonna absolutely destroy his crawlers. Like, lock them down immediately. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> So that should not be an issue anymore. Um, one thing though, uh, I kind of still want more of the scorpions, but we can get those next round. So getting the uh, Vulcan here was the correct choice. Correct choice. That's gonna see me just devastate these motherfucking uh, crawlers. Gonna get absolutely roasted. He's gonna be so unhappy when he sees the, the shielded guy here. Gonna be like, God damn it. He did go for heavy armor. Which is also very strong. Oh, he got... Oh, dude. That's way too early to go Siege Mode. Way too early. Now I can counter it by going Mechanical Rage. He's gonna be sad, dude. He's gonna be super sad. Ah, this is way too early for Siege Mode, man. He should have stuck to uh, either Range or Acid. I do need Range of my own here, but... God damn, that's way too early. Like, just... Oh, man. This usually only works if you have like really slow units, like um, I guess I do have a lot of fangs. And then you would need to, you need to put these further back, uh, to be honest, because uh, yeah. And any, you always want the normal range first because it doesn't reduce the damage. So I, I, I don't, rushing siege mode, let's see how this goes though. Oh, he's trying to flank me, it's cheeky. Oh, this is bad, actually. This flank is super bad for me. Yeah, he's gonna get to the tower. Oh, man. Well, at least we killed his uh, crawlers before anything else happened. This guy needs to turn around. Dude. Yeah, this sucks. It's stuck on the... Okay, we got it. Oof. We got him. We killed all the crawlers. I actually thought this side would win faster. But for some reason it didn't. So I'm thinking this actually kind of worked for him. Even though it shouldn't have. Uh, so, yeah, we need to... Ooh. ooh, that's cheeky. We could do some shenanigans here. Yeah, we can charge his backline. 
He is pretty protected though. We could also just uh, reinforce our own front line. I think that would actually work better. I think that would work better. Yeah. So we're gonna do this. These are very strong, by the way. We're just gonna safeguard our sides here. So it doesn't do any more shit to us. Uh, I'm gonna put these at the same range here so that they come in together with the phoenixes. Rhinos are very fast though, so they do uh, they do they do move super fast. Uh, I don't need to give them any abilities at the moment. We're not gonna lean into them. We're just gonna get them. I'm gonna get a bunch of these. We're gonna do an upgrade. We need to upgrade our chaff too. About one step at a time. Uh, this guy could be... Yeah, he has range, so we're gonna upgrade that. Oh, god damn, this is gonna be good. I think this is gonna be a big win for us. We also need to stabilize because we lost half our health here. So, King of Camelot, Mr. Arthur there, we're gonna kick him in the nuts here in a moment. It's gonna be like, oh, okay, he went for Fortress, that's a bit of an issue. It's actually not too bad, though. I mean, it, uh, it kinda is bad, and he upgraded his, uh, still no range here? Kinda weird. Um, what else did he, he went for Arclight? With the Arclights, no upgrades yet. Oh man. Yeah, this this fortress is not doing too much. It's doing something, but not too much. While the uh, rhino is actually absorbing a lot of damage. Yeah, this is really good, man. Okay, I need to. I can lean into the rhinos a little bit. Just not too much. Because it actually absorbed a lot of damage. Look at this guy, man. Going ham on a biscuit. Ha ha ha! Goddamn. Yeah, yeah, we definitely, we, I mean, I, I already predicted this, right? That we would do a lot of damage, but this worked, worked out very well. Mr. Camelot! King of Camelot, Mr. Arthur, you're gonna, you're getting kicked in the balls. Uh, Battleship could be pretty strong here. He has almost no range, or like entire. He does have that. Yeah, he has almost no entire. It's just a wonder, but it could be. Deployment specialist is also very good. Um, but I don't need to deploy that many more units. Alright, we're doing this. I'm gonna see if this can take out his uh, marksman. Actually, I'm just gonna put it on the side, just in case. Because I don't want all the marksmen to shoot at the same time. Don't die too fast. Um, Alright, so. Um, I think this is just upgrade time. We just need to upgrade. We need range, we need... Um... I think we just need to repair up. Make our front line more sturdy, maybe, with armor enhancement. I think that's better. Um... And these guys, oh yeah. I can give them armor too, I can also give them photonic coating. I think photonic coating is stronger. But these are level 3, so this is actually... Nah, this is actually stronger. But both would be best, of course. Yeah. And then, um... We can actually just reinforce with a few more units here. Not a big deal. Just getting some more. Um... Do we want to put them in the middle here? I guess we do. <laughs> we ran out of time. Okay. I'm not used to talking at the same time as I'm playing, I guess. Oh, he went for another fortress. Um, yeah, I mean, that makes sense. I think he's still gonna lose, though. But yeah, that makes sense. These are so hard to kill now. Like, the rhinos are so hard to kill. Once I get the, uh, the photon coating, they're gonna be almost impossible to kill. Oh, I don't, I, I don't think I need the photon coating. Holy. Oh my god, man. These guys are absolutely insane. Okay, I mean, we can put photon coating on them, but I... I don't know if we need it. Also, this guy killed the tower, so... That did help us out a lot. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> GG's, King Arthur! Well played, thank you, sir. Thank you, thank you. Always a nice guy to play against. Oh, man. That was a good fight. Very good fight. Um, 
Did he? I I mean, I think he went too much into the. I mean, obviously the the forces that didn't do anything. He was trying to tank up against my damage. Um, what else could he have done that would have devastated me? Um, I didn't have a good. Uh, I did not have a good anti air, so he. I think he should have gone Overlord instead, and then maybe uh, added uh, Wasps in. That would have been better for him. Uh, or even going for Wraith would have been better for him, potentially. Uh, because I only had very few Phoenixes and they weren't upgraded. <clears throat> but he didn't really notice it, so... You know, I just kept leaning into what was working, which was the Scorpions and the, uh, the Vulcans, of course. These two units were are working very well together. Just want to point that out. Whenever you see too many crawlers, you just go Vulcan. <laughs> if you see too many um, Flechamas, you can go Fortress. Or you can just go like Overlords. The problem with the Fortress right now is that the range on it is, um, is very short. Um, I have noticed though that the, the Fang production is not the greatest if you don't have your Fangs upgraded. If you have your Fangs upgraded though, that's pretty good. But... I don't know if I want to change it out. I could go normal range on it because it's a big issue with the, the forces that the, the range is so bad. Um, but then again, it won't really do much. I guess it does do a lot because you'll be able to outrange most of the smaller units, which is what you want to kill with it. Hmm. But but these are so good if you have Fang upgrades. So if you go forces with this Fang production. You kind of have to lean into your fangs a little bit. You have to have range at least, and maybe a shields too. So if you if he has a melting point, you can just put that in there to counter it. I think it's still too good. I think it's too good to not do. You could also arm up though, but it doesn't help against the melting points. And you really do want the anti air barrage because it's so good against the like phoenixes or like uh, wasps. And it does decent damage against big units too, so it's 9,900 damage per missile and it shoots 16 missiles, right? So it's a good amount of damage. <clears throat> it is a little bit lackluster late game against bigger air units, but it's pretty good against the small ones. I think that's the best build for the uh, fortress, to be honest. Go ahead on a biscuit. Ah. I'm gonna pause some music a little bit, guys. Hope you don't. Hope you guys don't mind. Hmm. We'll do this game, and then I will get something to drink. So I'm running out. Oh, loading in. Oh yeah. All right, what do we get? Uh, cost control with fangs and sledgehammers is my favorite. Absolutely favorite uh, build right now. Uh, this one is good too, the, the supply specialist with arc light and sledgehammers. <clears throat> but I prefer the cost control unit because, or specialist, because um, you get your chaff out so fast. It's actually kind of insane. Um, I've been wondering if it's better to go outwards. I'm wondering if it's better to spread your units out here. I'm going to try this. I don't usually do it because... Um, because I... It, because I want to like push through the middle usually, but... I think this might actually be better, so you don't clump up your middle units too much here. Hmm. It does kind of leave up a big opening. Yeah, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like that. It's... Uh, because it, it, they can like push you into the middle and your middle is super weak now. That's not going to be fun. Uh, so I'm just going to realign these. My standard formation. I am going to put these on the outside though so they don't get crushed by like uh, the phoenixes immediately. <clears throat> and then uh, we're going to get our 
you let's see this is perfect it's almost perfect like i can almost get like my all my chaff in one go uh, i just need one more stack of uh, sledgehammers and uh we will be set um so what does he have he does have a lot of smaller units so if we can just take care of them i'm gonna go arc lights here uh for next round so we have some arc lights to deal with yeah he has a lot of fangs oh he's going he's going heavy on the fangs and crawlers oof luckily i do have a lot of good units here that's gonna deal with it But yeah, he's trying to kill my fangs so his uh, phoenixes don't die. Unfortunately for him, I have uh, a lot of sledgehammers. These are gonna die here though, this is bad. It's gonna take a minute for my uh, units to get over there. I'm gonna lose my sledges, sadly. Okay. We're still gonna win. Oh. Put my sledge over there. Oh, maybe we're gonna win. Okay, there we go. <laughs> that was actually closer than I thought it would be. I also forgot to check which specialist he is. Ooh, early missile strike is actually really good here. Um, his units are yeah, they're a little bit clumped up. Uh, yeah, we can make this work. Okay, so. I want my sledges and uh, you know since we have our chef right now like a basic chef we can put more um, of these guys behind here I actually kind of want to go into oof, we can almost get one of the scorpion units just can't really just barely um, I think leveling Vulcan here is actually a um, decent idea um, we can get phoenixes though. I guess it's phoenixes. I'm wondering if that's worth it. I think that might be worth it. Yeah. Yep. That's what we're doing. I'm gonna put these guys over here. Uh, uh, we need to line this up. Uh, so these are gonna move forward. I might not hit the crawlers here, but as long as I kill his phoenixes, we should be okay. Um, yeah. I think that's it. Um, next round, we'll see what he does and then we'll react to it. Probably gonna go Scorpions though. Ooh, okay, we got Stone Crawlers. So he is, uh, he's going Crawlers, Stone Crawlers, which are very difficult to deal with. So we need to get, uh, we need to get the Vulcans out, actually, uh, to deal with the chat fast. And then we need uh, me Mechanical Rage so our, our tanks can dodge the rockets. <clears throat> We did kill his uh, phoenixes, so that's pretty good. And our phoenixes are going to be super good against these. But yeah, I hate Stormcrawler spammers. There's a lot of players who just spam them and just, you know, overwhelm their enemy. I hate those units, man. I think they uh, they still fire too fast. But yeah, he, he, it didn't go too well for him here because he... He, um, he has a bit of a weird... Oh, this is perfect. We got the damn barrier again. This is perfect, man. This is actually perfect. I can't believe we got that again. Yeah, this is... This is, like, can't be much better. I mean, um... We don't have enough for another Vulcan, but that's fine. Um... I could potentially borrow here. And uh, get another 200 supplies, and then... Oh, he surrendered. Alright, GG's, man. GG's, right, bad. GG's, man. Uh, we had a good strategy too. We we knew how to win this game, pretty much. Um, I guess maybe Rightbeard was watching the stream. <laughs> I guess he was like, "God damn, fuck this man, I'm out." Um, sorry if I I I don't hate people who go stone crawler, crawlers. Um, that's not what I meant. I just I just don't like the unit, uh, because I think it's too. It's too one-dimensional and it's very strong against ground units like as soon as someone spams out the storm callers and you have and they have like crawlers um it is very difficult to to deal with the um with them on the ground 
like they become such a menace especially when you have the fire on them where they set the ground on fire and all the small units just die <clears throat> it is so insane um and that's why as soon as i see these i just go uh go for the vulcans to completely clear out the, the ground units and then let the tanks run in with uh with the uh mechanical rage and it actually works like 95 percent of the time <laughs> like people especially if you already have your sledgehammer set up <clears throat> it's very difficult for the enemy to deal with because he he doesn't have a ground unit to to stop the sledgehammers and then i even had phoenixes on the back right so yeah i just completely countered his build um which is a little bit unfortunate for him but yeah i guess i guess you weren't watching um was it razorback something like that um but yeah that's what that's what was happening man i i have seen that build a hundred times or something and i've been countering it every time so it's been uh been uh been some tough rounds with against stone crawlers but i kind of got a hang of it now <clears throat> also stone crawlers are very unpredictable late game uh so if if we get really late like i'm talking rounds like round eight or something or nine um i can easily just completely nullify them with uh with some other stuff and things so they are they are very random i forgot to get something to drink oh my god man i'm gonna get something to drink i'll be right back guys i'm thirsty Oh, what are we getting? Ooh. I don't like the elite one, so I'm just gonna go supply specialist there. Uh, elite one is difficult to pull off with my strategy here because it requires you recruit high level units immediately, but they cost more, so. Uh, marksman, yeah, it's a good one. Marksman specialist is good. Uh, and I have, I use a lot of smaller units. There we go. I use a lot of smaller units. Um, I don't know if I like this. I zoomed out. That's how I did that thing, by the way. Okay, let me see. Mm, so we need... I'm gonna do this immediately. Not even looking at his units. I just want to get my chef up and running. Um, he has one elite marksman, so that's dangerous for tanks here. I might actually go um, go more if he goes into marksman early. I might go more fangs just to deal with the uh, elite marksman because that guy is uh, quite nasty. Um, let me see. I'm gonna put a little bit of distance on this. I'm gonna see if I can overwhelm his uh, left flank here completely. I can get into the marksman. I think that's gonna work. Damn. Okay, he didn't. Okay, he, he has separated his forces here, so that's good. Uh, this is gonna be bad, maybe potentially. He might get in there. He also got phoenixes instead of the uh, marksman. Okay, that's weird. I would not have thought that. If I go marksman, uh, I would go like. If I go the, uh, what's it called again? Marksman Specialist, I usually go Marksman. Oh yeah, okay, he's getting... Getting devastated on the left, as I was hoping. Crawlers are doing that work. Very nice. Very nice. Easy win. Sorry, Sonny. He went for a very greeny build with uh, Phoenixes. Oh yeah, we're definitely going Supply Specialist here. Holy. That is quite good. I think they stack, right? Did I make a mistake? Do they not stack? I think they stack. Um... 
I'm gonna buy. No, I'm not. I want to buy field recovery, but then I have to sell one of these. I'm gonna wait with selling anything. Get my tanks up and running. Um, <clears throat> I could be selling these crawlers right now, but I kind of want him to counter my crawlers before I start selling them. Um. I'm gonna upgrade these immediately, yeah. Oh, yeah. It does kind of show that I'm not going into crawlers, right? But it's too good. Can't not do it. Um yeah, he's going high. No, maybe maybe arc lights would have been okay, well. Fine. Maybe I should have gone arc lights there, but it doesn't matter, I can get them next round if I Oh Okay, that was a mistake. I should have seen for seen that. I should have thought about that. <clears throat> I should have gotten given level 2 to these guys and faded the uh, like uh, made him believe that I was going strong crawler army this would also have been way more effective here yeah that was a mistake small mistakes though I'm still winning I really don't want these phoenixes to level up very important because once they get higher level they become so difficult to deal with you can see these guys are leveling up on my uh... oh man i lost because i don't have any anti air left that is bad that's very bad all right so we might have leaned into the uh slate hammers a little bit too hard there but that's it's fine Ooh, incinerary bomb is bad for us I don't really like any of these, not yet anyways. We're gonna start selling all of the uh, rollers. Um, so here's the issue. He's probably gonna go incinerary and try to blow up my front line. And if he succeeds, he's gonna do some damage to me. Um, I don't know if he's gonna do too much though. But I might have to use some shields here. Um, so, I'm actually just gonna go two armies of these, and then I am protecting my middle here. I'm gonna protect my uh, small guys because, because I don't want him to, I want my small guys to take out his phoenixes late game here, so I could also protect my side here. But that's a lot of resources. I don't know if I want to do that. I could also upgrade. Or I could get another group of uh, things. Upgrading on round 3 is a little bit of a bad idea. So I'm actually going to get another group. Go. That should be okay. I'm going to save the rest of the money. Got the scorpion right there. Okay, he didn't go anything so what did he do what did he take he, he went giant hunter okay interesting i would not have imagined going uh, that he would go giant hunter there i need something to help my tanks here because they're getting uh they're getting devastated by the marksman so i might need a new set of crawlers that are closer to the tanks to absorb some of the damage this thing is doing so much damage to me. I still do have a lot of uh, guys left, so we should be okay. Yeah, see, these are level 2. See how difficult they are now to deal with? God damn, man. I think we're still okay, though. Yes! Destroy him! Take him down! Good. Ooh, these can almost get levels here. Um, okay. Two Wraith. Hackers. Oh, God. That's bad for me. That is very bad for me. I think I might want to go Mustang here because if he goes Hackers and I go any of these, it's going to be bad. I'm going to go Mustang. Mustang's also better than... Uh, yeah, 
These things are quite good here, actually. Let's sell these guys here. Um, still kind of want to get some uh, crawlers here in the front. Actually, what I really want to do is move these tanks back to the back line. But I can't right now. Um, so I want to put these right here. And then I want to put these... Put them right there. So I, I guess I can leave these here. Just get an upgrade here. Yeah. I could go damage reduction. Would make these very difficult to deal with. And upgrade them. Yeah, that's what we're doing. I wanted to go scorpions, but I think this is better. Personally, I think this is better. Like, we're putting way more um, HP on the field against his uh, damage. Oh, that's bad. Vulcan's bad. That is very bad for us. I did not think he would go Vulcan here, honestly. Uh, Wraith? Yeah, I knew he would. I kind of knew he would go Wraith. So they're gonna die very easily right now, but later it's gonna be an issue because uh, Mustangs are not good against Wraith in the once they get armor upgrades. Right now they're okay though. Oh, this is gonna be bad. No, don't roast them. This tank needs to lift. Okay, we lift. Whew. Yeah, we need um, we need some protection against the uh, the Vulcans. I might actually have to rush uh, fortresses out. I just don't like rushing Fortress because he does have Giant. He's gonna make a lot of money on my uh, Giants. So maybe just going uh, level 2 Scorpions might be the choice here. I think that's the choice. Uh, so they're gonna cost... Oh, we could also go Phoenix. Ooh. Oh, my... oh God, okay. 30% more HP is a lot. That's a lot of HP. Too fatty. It's too expensive though. I can't do it. Oh, that felt bad. Okay. That felt very bad. So we are gonna go level 2. We're gonna go level 2 Scorpions. And uh, yeah. I need this Scorpion to take care of the... Uh, of these guys here. I need these to die. So I'm actually gonna go and borrow. I'm gonna give them range. They should log on to the uh the, the Vulcans in time. Uh if they don't, it's gonna be a little bit of a difficult match. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave these crawlers by the way. They seem to be seem to be doing really well. So I think that's best. Um I'm gonna need more scorpions though if, if this works. Oh, scorpions was was a good choice, man. Yeah, that that was a really good choice. Like really good choice. He's, he's just gonna get blown up. This is still bad. This is still bad. Okay, okay, we're good. It's locked on. It's locked on. The scorpions locked on. Woo! We got it. All right. <laughs> yeah, he surrender. <laughs> Sunny, GG spin. I'm so sorry, dude. I'm so sorry. I've been playing this game a lot. I'm not gonna lie. That's, uh, you know, it's rough playing against me right now. Woo we're getting up there in rank. Good times, man. That was the exact, exact correct time to go, uh, like high level scorpions because he didn't, um, he didn't have anything, uh, to, to handle the scorpions and Vulcans are terrible against scorpions they're good with scorpions but they're terrible against them so yeah that was pretty good and he didn't have any uh, he didn't have enough um he didn't have enough uh what is it called um what do i call it again he didn't because he went rave he didn't have the phoenixes that he needed oh no he got he got those from a, a card actually um Oh, I should have watched the... Uh, what, what else did he go? Oh, because he because he went Vulcan, which didn't make sense. Um, because Vulcans are not that great against Sledgehammers, right? 
um, because he went Vulcan, like two of them, he went. He used a lot of resources on them, and he also upgraded, I think. Uh, so uh, he didn't have any any uh, phoenixes to, to stop anything that I would uh, like. Scorpions, he didn't have anything to stop them, so that was insane. 